with we got the fifty per fifty four percent of the. I don't have my notes on it, but fifty four percent of non NDC support. Right. Yes. Yes. Good. Good. It cannot differentiate okay, good. between the new NDC and the old NDC. Right. Good. So what so, are the characteristics right. that are there right. that would make people? You yes. Know, uh, um, yes. So, so we had uh, a, a question here. What we, we asked them, okay? Um, when in the question we ask persons, if you can, uh, uh, people who were just from from our, our um, um, uh, triangulations, we 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 excluded NDC, NDC supporters. So we just be speaking with. And, and um, non NDC supporters, we asked them. Mm -hmm. So they they believe that the NDC is just one party. We asked them, hey, do you believe that there is a a, a new NDC and an old NDC, a new God, old God? Okay, they could not ident uh, identify with that. They also be and and this is the the whole perception. I think that that the N NDC has a perception issue that they have to work at you know very uh, seriously the perception of of persons is that the ndc is a like a bourgeois party the ndc is a party of the rich the ndc is a party of the educated and shun people who are not rich and not educated that is the perception that most people have it is not true but it's the perception, and I think that the and this perception is also echoed in the NNP camp, because I think that after the elections, they are, they are they are the budget actually. I I heard one of the party leaders mention the same idea, mention the same statement, okay. But so the NDC now has to work on that, you know, very diligently to to promote and expose the doing of the of the NDC, how they are in they're totally involved in both serving both rich and poor, educated and uneducated. There, there are educated people who are who are NNP and there are educated people who are who are, are NDC. There are uneducated people who are NDC, etc. And they have to engage the the um, the persons on that. Because people could not even though they the uh, uh, the majority of a person that we interviewed saw the N N NDC as just one. I know that, and and especially Doc, um, uh, uh, Mr. Uh, the Deacon Mitchell, Prime Minister Deacon Mitchell. If if he, if he positioned himself as a new NDC, as a new part of, uh, as a new emerging NDC, this NDT trend. That tend to generate a certain momentum. Will gather a lot of the the younger voters, and gather a lot of the the their the voters. But so he has to try to differentiate himself from 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 that that NDC of let's say two thousand eight to two thousand and 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 um, thirteen. The, that that area where the NDC the uh, uh, divided among themselves. So he has to work. On very um, uh, to 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 e eradicate that feeling and that opinion from from the general population. Um, secondly, the NNP supporters, from based on the narrative of the election, based on the campaigning of the election, uh, the NNP support many of the NNP supporters believe that if elected, the NDC would not last five years. And that is something that the NDC now has to work to disprove. Okay, they have to work. They have to be more united. They have to work in 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 in, in coordination with with each other. They have to have have an established leader, a leader who tend to be a leader, both in public and 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 out of public, and they need to have a path that they can follow. I I believe that the uh, the the present. Uh, uh, political leader, Doctor uh, uh, Mr. Um, Deacon Mitchell, is capable because he has some of the characteristics that we identified in a leader. And in, in, in a leader in Grenada, we we pull the person, we ask them what you want in a leader, and the thirteen characteristics that they wanted is is also present in Mr. Mr. Deacon Mitchell. So even though I believe that things will get better, 
Okay, he's he just he's just is getting started. He's not even in in uh, four years yet, but in the next couple of months and years, he will be somebody that will not only recognize in Grenada but but regionally and in, uh, internationally, because he has that characteristics of 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 leadership. There's, there's, there's an interesting article.